You see all my names out there? Huh? You see all my names out there? I'm just asking. Yeah, I'm stop. I'm going your ass. I know some bullshit. I ain't gonna hold you. I ain't, I ain't flying um, Economy Plus in a minute. So this is my first time flying the Economy Plus with my girl and the baby. Mm. From where to where? From just from North to Richmond. That's quick flight. Quick flight. Yeah. Like hour, 45 minutes, some shit. Mm. Bro, shit you couldn't do it? That shit was a monster. Mom. I'm 6'2", nigga. That shit was different. I, yo, dog, I'll... F- they ain't had no more first class flights coming back from Richmond. I drove all the way to DC to get a first class flight. Damn. So, so I you. remember the conversation we just had about like the bag being going in. Yeah, things yeah, like yeah. this. Yeah. Add to the bag. Add yeah. to that. So you got a rental to drive to DC. <laughs> yeah, to so get a, you get first get class. class. No, I rented the car when I got to uh, Richmond, but I went to DC from Richmond just so I could. Uh, the funny shit sure. about what you're saying is on those 45 minute flights, because sometimes the first class don't even really be a first class. Nah, I don't, but, no, but it, a bigger seat. It's, it's a bigger seat. It's a wider seat. Front. It's yeah, a wider seat. for your fucking hips. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> hey, dog. You need a wide robotics. That was crazy. That was, like, that that was, that was crazy. That was crazy. <laughs> that was <laughs> different. Why, yeah, so why did you just get the exit, bro? Nigga, they don't lean back. That's it's a 40-minute flight, and it's still skinny-ass seat. Uh, you're a little bougie. Yo, Joe Netto is hilarious. The wide hips comment was definitely an I-yo moment, but it was funny content. I'm not sure about the full backstory with the hips, but from the reaction of the others, was its own entertainment. This reminds me of one of the topics discussed in the past about weird moments on podcasts, specifically with Mojo Adam and DW Flame. For the record, I understand why DW Flame didn't want to play any of the games that Adam was playing on the platform, But that's probably because Adam plays too much and pushes the lines and boundaries as much as possible when playing. Comedy is for everyone, and finding the right time to tell a joke can make or break a show. Joe is putting on a masterclass on how to time this type of joke, right after the person brings it on themselves. But the fact that more fish had to take a first-class flight just for the seat is an interesting story in itself. The question is can you consider what more fish did to be bougie or just better living? More Fish took a rental car that he already had and drove close to an hour away because the closer airport didn't have any first-class seats for him. As far as content is concerned, this is a perfect scenario to break down. Calling him bougie is hilarious, especially with the fact that he is trying to deny it. But as far as stepping your game up, who would deny the ability to be able to make these moves at free will? I view it as a perfect inspirational moment for others, to step your game up and reach the point and privilege of booking first-class flights, by any means necessary. Let's see what's next.